Welcome back. There was a major leadership shuffle in 2007. The Army welcomed a new Chief of Staff and Secretary. Crystal Park joins us with a look at what they did during their first year in office. Both leaders have been pushing family support for Army families since day one. General George Casey Jr. and Secretary Pete Guerin have spent their first year on the job traveling around the world, making sure soldiers and their families know they're being taken care of. General George Casey replaced General Peter Schoomaker, becoming the 36th Army Chief of Staff April 10, 2007. General Casey had been commanding multinational force Iraq before being chosen for the top job. General Casey praised the troops' service and vowed to improve quality of life. Remarkable men and women of our all-volunteer force, supported by their dedicated families, are a national treasure and will be cared for accordingly. Pete Guerin was sworn in as the new Secretary of the Army on August 30th this year. At his arrival ceremony, Guerin echoed General Casey's commitment to Army families. Our Army must continue to examine the ever-changing needs of our families and never cease in our effort to provide our families that quality of life that is commensurate with their service. In October, General Casey and Secretary Guerin put their money where their mouth is when they introduced the Family Covenant at this year's annual meeting of AUSA. General Casey also announced his four imperatives necessary to keep the Army the strength of the nation. Sustain, prepare, reset, and transform. Leaders visited installations around the world signing the Covenant, which pledges better health care, support programs, and housing for families. Effects of the Covenant are already evident. The Residential Committee's initiative, or RCI, is bringing better homes for more families. RCI partners the Army with private sector expertise and financial resources for better homes. Secretary Guerin visited some Fort Belvoir residents who were more than thrilled with the outcome. We're both military brats ourselves, and we've seen it all, from the worst to the best, and this is by far the best. Improving family support is a journey, will never be a destination. 